All right, gorgeous. Welcome back. Thanks. So, Rebecca, how are things? Mm, so so. What's going on? A uh, bit of a long day. You, you're the last couple of times you've been here. You were upbeat and very perky. Today, you're a little bit. A yeah, little bit no, down. I'm just. I've been sleeping all night. I don't usually sleep too much, so yeah. So you're you're short on sleep right now? No, like too much sleep. Oh, too much sleep. Yeah. And, uh, what, what, I mean, so your typical day, how, how, how drug use is, what, how, how, how big is drug use in your day? It's not imperative, but it's there. Yeah. Yeah. So you typically you'll wake up and you'll do wake what? Wake up, get high, run around. <laughs> you're, 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 I just, I keep to myself, honestly. Really? Yeah. And, and nobody, nobody bothers you? Mm-mm. Yeah. I mean, sometimes, you know what I mean? It happens. But I've, I've never yeah. seen you with black eyes or bruised up or anything like that. Mm. Fortunately for that. Do you, do, you have, do you have a goal for your, set for yourself where, where you'd like to be in a couple of years or something like that? I, I already told you that. I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I forget some of our conversations. I have so many conversations, I forget them. <laughs> I guess I just want to get into the fashion industry. I guess I just really like Oh, that's fashion. right. We did talk yeah. about that. Yeah. And do you have any romantic interests in your life? Not right now. Yeah. No? Uh, there is someone, but I... A little complicated. And what does he look like? I don't want to talk about it. You don't want to talk about it? Okay. What do you want to talk about? Anything? No, no. No, you go ahead. I don't really have anything to say today. A bit of a pencil day. You get depressed sometimes? Sometimes. Do you, I mean, would you, would you consider yourself someone who has, like, you know, depression that's... That, Nags them, or I'd say it's just a polarity. Just bipolar stuff. I guess, yeah. Do you go to the mission sometimes to eat? Mm, not really. Where do you Where do you eat? I know. I guess I just kind of like I find food, like I dumpster dive and stuff. You do. Yeah. And eating out of a dumpster is is okay for you? I mean, as long as you know what I mean. Like, um, how do I put it? Um, I've never really gotten sick. Like, I've been very fortunate. So. You haven't gotten sick. Yeah. I mean, the, the the lack of responsibility that this lifestyle has is, is that is that appealing to you? Is that, is that what? I would suppose so. It's not about responsibility as much as uh, self recklessness. I don't know. Like, um, it's a better way to get to understand yourself or kind of uh, be of your own rather than uh, within a um, what do they call it? Like a kind of a modality or a pattern or something. Is there something attractive? I mean, you, you told me you loved Skid Row before. Is there something about the f the freedom or the or the? I think it's just more of an energy. You know what I mean? Like there's, um, I'm able to have like there's um, there's room for self-expression without like I don't necessarily need to interact because I, I just like I tend like I prefer to keep to myself lately. I just wonder if there's a a psych medication or something that you're not taking that might help you stabilize and maybe help you? Not really. No? But, you know. Yeah, I'm not a doctor. What's the nicest thing that's happened to you lately? Um, probably just being on myself. I don't know. Probably just being, being alone. What do you miss about your old life? Nothing. Nothing? Nothing. What do you hope for? Hmm, just to keep kind of the pace that I'm at, or to kind of keep uh, practicing how I'm practicing, or kind of existing how I exist, you know what I mean? And family is not part of your life any longer? Uh, it isn't, it isn't. It's uh, like it's a presence, but at the same time, like, family is really important to me, though. My family are really important to me. They are? Yeah. No, I fucking love my family. You love your family? Yeah. Do you ever have contact with him? Sometimes. It's, um, I don't know. I'm kind of doing what I'm doing right now. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's clear. Is your family concerned for you? I wouldn't think so. I think I'm doing all right. Yeah. Are you concerned for you? Yes and no. Like, I like the pace that I'm at. Like, I like the self-sustainability, but at the same time, um, like I'm trying to find ways to evolve. You know what I mean? 
I mean, I and I, I think a lot of my viewers have see so much potential in you. Mm -hmm. Like I, I, every time you come by, you're just like, oh, there's there's my friend Rebecca. I would love to see her just get her shit together and just because I see so much potential. But you, that's what I want to do. Your personality is so exactly. Likeable. That's what I want to do. It's just a matter of how to communicate it or how to communicate what it is that I'm doing because I think there's so much what I'm doing that's not as understood or it's maybe because it's coming from a self or it's coming from a place like the way that I practice or the way that I exist it's not as immediately perceivable but at the end of the day like I know how I'm going about it because I'm coming from a place of awareness or maybe attempting to instigate something new you know what I mean rather than rely on an outdated modem or an outdated understanding of how to exist. Well, I mean, there's been many, many people I've interviewed and I, I would love to see a stable, clear-headed version of down the road. I would just love to see what you're like with your life together, maybe like with a little responsibility, a little like, you know, discipline and like a little bit of like a life and solidity in your life it would yeah. be very interesting to see who you're who you are then or just or just more um continuity i guess or some something yeah, yeah just not stabi like not stability but like something um like reliability i guess yeah i mean yeah. I'm, I'm repeating myself but I, I just see so much potential in you and it's like it just seems like it's it's wasted here on skid row i, w I would say that i feel that i would say that i don't i don't know you're a very interesting person thank you and you're beautiful. I think your 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 face and the, just your energy and your your personality are so likable. Thanks. I just hope you you get it together somehow. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I don't Me even either. know. I don't I even know. Idea. I have no idea. I'm not sure you you so know. Much right now. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm gonna give you some lunch money, and uh, I can't wait to see what you're wearing next time I see you. I have so too. Stop by anytime. Thanks. I love seeing you. Thanks. Thanks. Okay, Rebecca, you're back. Hi. I love what you're wearing today. <laughs> Thank you. Where'd thanks. you find that? I just found it on the floor. You just found it somewhere? Yeah. The, the garment district is right near Skid Row, so yeah. you find stuff like this sometimes. Um, are you in a better mood today? Kind of, kind of. Still kind of down? Yeah. What's going on? Like up and down, I don't know. Um, it's like, I feel like something really good's gonna happen to me but like something that I've been waiting for almost. Cool. Yeah. It's nice to have that feeling. Yeah. What's going on, what's on your wrist? Were you in a hospital? Yeah, I was, I was in the hospital. What for? Um, I, was, I was feeling kind of suicidal, so. Oh no. Yeah. That, does that happen, happen often? Yeah, sometimes. And then what do they give you for that? Um, they, they didn't give me anything. It's just kind of this place, Exodus, like you can just kind of go and relax for a yeah, bit. Yeah, no Exodus. Yeah. Taking Amanda over there. Yeah. Um, what? To, so, what gets you out of a, a down mood like that? I don't know. Usually, time. Just finding, yeah, just time and. Sometimes sleep helps, right? Yeah. No, I've been because I've been sleeping a lot lately. Usually, like when I sleep, it just kind of like messes with me. So I'm just kind of ready to get back up and. So you're feeling like more positive right now. Yeah. Good. Yeah. It's great. Like it, like it was a better morning than I would have presumed it to be. Good. Yeah. Well, I hope you have a great rest of the day and week and whatever good thing you're having a premonition about is great. Yeah. All right. Be careful out there. I will, yeah. All right, Rebecca, thanks. All right, thanks.